What story will your high school transcript tell? No matter what form of education you wish to pursue after high school, the admissions officers will read your transcript to learn all they can about who you are and what you have to offer their school. Make sure the story you have to tell reflects who you are and what you can do. Hi, I'm Margaret Meek, and this is Telling Your Academic Story Through Your Transcript. If you are an incoming freshman high school student or a junior selecting classes for your senior year, make sure what is presented on your transcript reflects who you are and whom you are becoming. So what stories can be learned by looking at your transcript? A reviewer can understand how often you sought academic challenges, the topic categories which interest you most. They can learn if you are college ready, what you value, if you are improving as a student, if you had a rough term, or if you didn't take your senior year seriously enough. Those who review transcripts for a living will be looking to see that you made the most of your high school experience. When planning courses, the beginning point for any student is to earn the credits necessary to graduate high school. The state sets requirements and your school or district may add to that list. These core class requirements in language arts, history, science, math, and more also allow you to take particular courses that are interesting to you while still meeting the baseline expectations from the school and the state. Know what those expectations are and what courses meet the requirements. The next step is to review your school's list of course options available. This includes courses taught within the school, dual enrollment options, the availability of courses in nearby or district high schools, and other options available through trade or specialized programs in your community. Decide which of the courses are interesting to you. This can be because of the subject matter, because they would enhance your understanding of a career you would like to follow, or because you want to challenge yourself. Now look at the terms you have left in high school to piece together what classes you need to take each term to graduate with the coursework you know will help you succeed in your education and your life. Most high schools offer this style of worksheet. This document will become the outline of the story you want to write. This level of planning will help you think through some critical components of course planning, including making sure prerequisites are completed and that the levels of challenge and homework are balanced each term. This also allows you to plan for courses only offered at specific times of the academic calendar. Balance core and elective courses and courses that will enable activity versus straight lecture. If you wish to move into a science-based career, taking lab classes will be important. If you wish to become a teacher, take communication classes as well as classes in the field you may wish to teach. If you wish to become involved with computers, take an array of computer classes with electives in graphic arts or logic. If you have no idea what you want to be, take a wide variety of classes to see what sparks your interest and gives you a strong base from which to move forward. Your story needs to demonstrate growth a focus on your interests, and a balance between the classes you know you need and the classes that will help you see beyond your discipline. Go back and review your plan every term to ensure it still meets your needs. Adjust for course additions in the school, changes in teachers, and changes in your priorities. You do not have to come to high school ready to take every AP, IB, or college prep course available in your first term. Use your freshman year to grow your competency in all academic disciplines by continuing your progress from middle school. Take the next math course. Take a language arts course that helps you move forward in growing your skills. Take classes that will help you determine the best way to approach the rest of your high school career. Then start building the number of challenging courses you take each term. Fill out each term with interesting electives, subjects you haven't studied before, or courses that offer a life skill. Each term you want to build on your progress from the last term. If you are a sophomore or junior, review what you have taken, what you want to take, and write the outline for your story. As you select courses, remember the most challenging courses may or may not offer college credit. The college may not accept dual enrollment courses you choose. You may not get your college to take your AP or IB courses as credit, but that doesn't mean the class isn't worth taking. 
The course still helps you understand college level work and will help you show via your transcript that you are willing to take challenging classes strictly for the quality of the course. Please remember that colleges have a general knowledge of the courses and programs offered by your high school. The school creates an information sheet to provide colleges with that information. If your school doesn't have advanced course options, look for activities and experiences you can gain in your community to help you expand your knowledge. You can shadow a professional, volunteer with a community or school organization with a chance to show what you can do, or work through online classes to access the education you desire. If as you are looking at your record, you see reflections of challenging issues being faced in your life, begin to work through how you can make sure that is not the overwhelming story coming out of a transcript review. If you had a tough academic term or year, don't worry, that happens. Just be able to point to progress coming out of that time. As we speak of the importance of increasing the challenge you face in your coursework, we would be remiss not to mention grades. Do your best in every class. Don't panic if you earn a B in AP or IB courses. Getting a lower grade in a challenging course is not the kiss of death for your future. Remember that the idea is for you to learn the subject matter, not for you to earn a perfect GPA without remembering what you learned. Outline the journey you will take through high school. Go into each semester setting yourself up for success, then earn that success. Your transcript will tell a fantastic story about you if you do this. Have your counselor or a trusted teacher review your transcript and see what it tells them about you. Review the strengths, look for weaknesses, and begin to determine how you can make it even stronger moving forward. Your transcript should tell the academic story of your time in high school. Work to make sure your story is compelling. If you found any of this information useful, hit the like button or perhaps consider subscribing. And if you have any questions, let us know in the comments down below.